everyone! It's me, Rai Kontawi, and welcome to my channel. If you're a lipstick collector, specifically kung matte, na kung magdiwang kayo ngayon dahil napakalaking swatch party ang mangyayari ngayon because I will be swatching 37 shades out of the 40 shades ng L'Oreal's Color Rich Matte Lipstick Collection. Again, I repeat, 40 shades ang meron sila. Now, tungkol ba sa itong collection na ito? Na not only does it boast a wide range of shades, again, 40 shades, eh, ipinagmamalaki din nila ang moisturizing formula ng lipstick na to. Again, personally kasi ako, hindi rin ako gaanong mahilig sa anything matte. Like, matte lipsticks, I mean, I love them. I love the finish. But deep inside, struggle ako kung gaano kadrying minsan yung ibang lipstick products. But, um, this claims to be very moisturizing, very lightweight as well, and high pigmented and magandang coverage, which is too promising for a 350 peso lipstick. And so we're going to find out kung totoo ba yun. And so get ready for a big swatch party. Here we go. Let's start with the nude shades. Now amongst the 37 shades na ipapakita ko sa inyo ngayon, 14 of these are nude shades. And that for me is already parang a good thing. Napakaganda ng variety ng nude shades. You have browns, you have mauve shades, you also have na may peach undertone or parang light pink. And um, maganda na natap nila yung mga ganong klaseng nudes. And that makes it very universal for all skin complexions. So may babagay talaga for those na mapute at may babagay din sa mga morena. And of course, halos lahat naman ay babagay sa katamtaman lang. No? Um, here's the thing about nude shades. They tend to be less pigmented compared to, of course, the pinks or the reds or yung mga deeper ang shades. But this one, I, I would say na talagang highly pigmented. In one glide, makikita mo na nakakover na yung discoloration ng lips. I do have darker outline. Uh, but in one glide, nakikita ko na cover na siya without the need of lip liners. And again, that's a pro. Um, what else? Napakaganda ng formulation. Um, I tend to not like matte lipsticks in general, whether it's a lipstick or liquid lipstick, because they really dry out my lips. But with this formulation, it's very moisturizing, very easy to glide on, and it's very easy to apply. I've read that this contains jojoba oil, which makes it very easy to glide on the lips. And I do agree. It almost feels like it's a cream lipstick na parang hindi siya matte. So sobrang madali nang i-glide. You would think na naku magkakaroon ng shine. But no, actually just blot it with tissue or facial tissue. Uh, mawawala na talaga yung extra sheen and it will really give you this matte finish. Now, even though na creamy yung consistency niya, na parang ang parang uh, talagang madulas ano um, it feels lightweight and it does set to somehow a soft matte powdery finish and i also read about the product features that it does have or it is made of spherical powders to fill in and conceal lip lines for the full color in a swipe for up to six hours now again this claims to last up to six hours um not bad it's it's a it's a lipstick so Ang um, pros, I mean, ang cons lang nito would be it will transfer. It also has the tendency to smudge. But if you want it to last longer, I suggest that you do the blotting technique or you apply it and then blot and then apply the second layer, blot, until you get your desired coverage or your desired intensity. It is made from light scattering gel to give the pleasant lightweight feel without drying the lips. Which is, again, I would agree with that kasi nga talagang... You have to try this. You have to swatch this on your own, personally, over the counters. Just to, I cannot um, emphasize, I cannot stress enough how moisturizing this lipstick is. I cannot question the shades of this line because it's amazing how they came out with 40 shades. I have 37 of them. I'm sorry if three are missing because I, I don't have them, but rest assured, I can give you already parang an idea of what would the shades look like. Bilang na bilang yung sobrang bright, and uh, bilang na bilang yung um, parang sobrang tingkad na hindi na babagay o parang hindi na siya swak kumbaga sa skin tone and skin shades of Filipinas. So that's, that's really good. And also, you have a fair number of pinks and reds as well. I do love the red shades. Hands down sa lahat ng red shades. 
because iba-iba sila talaga ng color kahit sa screen mo kung pare-pareho but if you look closely nakita mo na yung isa cool toned red yung isa more of an orange toned red yung isa more of a cherry deep red yung isa naman parang wine red so it has it has a good stretch of of colors this retails 350 pesos and you can swatch these over the counters again sa lahat ng Laurel kiosks or stalls. Marami na sa department store or sa drug store. I sometimes see Laurel um, stalls sa groceries or sa supermarkets. So talagang accessible siya. And also, available din on Laurel sa Lazada. They have this official store na um, halos kompleto and they do this parang sale and uh, talagang magagandang promotions. So that's good. Accessibility is good. Price point is also very friendly. Sa lahat ng nagtitipid. It's not too cheap. It's not uh, too pricey. And for its quality, it's really, really good. Now we've come to the conclusion part. At dito natin manalaman kung i-recommend ko ba sa inyo itong product na ito. And the answer is, yes, in fact, I do highly recommend the product because i-recap natin kung ano yung pros and cons. Starting with the cons, may tendency talaga siya mag-smudge and mag-transfer. That's because it's a lipstick. And um, it's actually, it's actually parang a given con already na kahit ano naman kasing lipstick kahit pa matte, eh, hindi siya totally magiging transfer proof or smudge proof. But you can do the blotting technique para mabawasan yung pag-transfer niya. And uh, again, it will last for 6 hours, which is not, not parang sobrang tagal, no? But, but, for a matte lipstick like this, maganda na yun. And, um, kunyari, itong suot ko ngayon, kanina ko pa siya suot, kumain na ako kanina, nag-break na ako, kumain na ako, and ganito pa rin siya. So, I would say na talagang it doesn't come off quickly, it stays on the lips, and it does feel comfortable. Now, going to the pros, number one would be the shade range. A 40 shade range of matte, of just matte lipsticks is no joke. So, maganda na talagang kahit ano pang skin tone or complexion ninyo, meron at meron kayong makuwang magandang shade for you. And also, I do love the formula. Top-notch formula, very moisturizing. They stay true to their word na napaka moisturizing, madaling apply high high pigmented products, um, and it does feel lightweight. I'm surprised. Parang it's too good to be true to have those characteristics or qualities of a matte lipstick. Na parang wow, that's that's it's actually a pretty spot on formula, and they did it. I I have to say they they did a good job on the formula. Um, it doesn't feel drying up. Soft matte finish on the thing. It doesn't feel like napakadami kong layers na nilagay. But I do get this really nice coverage. I'm looking myself at the mirror and I'm really like just appreciating on how beautiful this red lipstick is. Um, my, my top favorites, ito pala yung mga favorite ko. Unahin mo natin sa nude shade. Uh -huh. I do have this Hinted Blush. Itong Hinted Blush is like a mauve warm rose shade, which is again like a warm rose thing, or warm rose shade is very universal na kahit sino ay talagang, you know, maisosot. So this is, sorry, ayun yung nag-swatch ako kanina. And then, um, binura ko na siya na makeup remover and soap. Hindi pa rin siya matanggal-tanggal. Yan ang sinasabi ko medyo uh, long-lasting siya. So ulitin ko na lang, no, yung pag-swatch ko. Kasi nag-swatch ako kung ano talaga yung parang Okay, ano ba yung magiging paborito ko dito? So, ito na nga. Ulitin natin. Ito yung Hinted Blush. Again, one glide. You can see na, oh my god, yun yun. So, masasot nyo siya for, for everyday use, or pagpupunta kayo sa office, or may special occasion kayo, basta you match it with a nice, parang eye look. And then, pagdating naman sa red lipstick, I love the rich Merlot, na parang deep red wine. Ayan, oh. Talagang isa lang, isang glide lang talaga, no? Talagang putok yung kulay. So, ang ganda. Ito yung suot ko ngayon. Ito yan, oh. And then, also, nakita ko kanina. It's actually a good comparison. It's actually a good thing. And uh, this is Ruby Woo. And I know that a lot of you guys love Ruby Woo and how red it is. And I did find a similar shade. And look at this. So, this is it. 
mas actually parang mas moisturizing yung L'Oreal. But I, what I do love about this comparison is that uh, where is it? This is 217 Bloody Mary. Check this out. Ching! See that? One glide. Good news, kumbaga, sa lahat ng nasa budget or those na ayon naman mag break ng bank, you can really get quality lipsticks from, or quality matte lipsticks from this line. I love it. I, I love it. Uh, yeah, I, that's the bottom line of everything. I'm excited for you to try out this product. Um, let me know what you think on the comment section below. And don't forget to get subscribed and notified para kung may mga bagong videos kayong unang makakapanood. Again, share your thoughts in the comment section below. Kung ano yung so far sa swatching pa lang, eh, yun ang napupusuan ninyo. And uh, kayo ba team nude, pink, plum, red, or violet? Yan. Alamin natin. Babasahin kyo sa comment section below. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. You can follow me pala on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Alatrizo Kantawi. And until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!